All right. Part, I don't know. What part is this? I forgot. So we're just jumping in this. Oh, wait till you see this Ooh, one. Oh, that one's gorgeous. God. Holy moly. Wow. Wow, wow, All wow. All right, and here we have Essence Elf. I didn't have many of this. Terra Dragon Milled Garmus. So this guy, he's Fortress Shell, except he's an Earth Dragon. So this guy, great card. I completely agree with his printing. Um, should have been printed a long time ago. Um, Toon Cannon. I didn't have many copies of him. Essence Elf didn't have many copies. Just wanted yeah, yeah. more. All right. All right, this one. We got... This one's a surprise. Now, this guy. Look how funny this fucker looks. He's shooting like a little... Look, he's like... He's, he's like, like Krang. He's like Krang. <laughs> then look at how beautiful this card is. Whoa, Jenny. Yeah, that... That this, might be the nicest this, card ever. This seen. might be one of the... Wow. Wow. That is a work of art. That's something to see in person. So both of these guys have something in common. They both look at the opponent's hand upon entering the battle zone, except this guy puts a card in the shields, and this girl puts a card in the graveyard. So this is more used in deck out decks, because um, your opponent won't see it, and there's a lot of recursion in the Japanese meta. So yeah, you're going to definitely have a lot of fun with both of these cards. We have a bell. Wow. Wow. Three. So I have like 14 envelopes. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's fine. Wow. All right. So this is one of my personal favorites. Dreaming Moon Knife. He's one of my personal favorite cards ever. I love this card. Um, he's pretty much poisonous mushroom, but is a beast folk. I love this card. I can't get enough. I think he should have been in the first set of Duel Masters. No reason why he shouldn't have existed in DM01 base set. Uh, Beast folks never got the love they should have. Miraculous Snare. As you can tell, I love my Miraculous Snare. Another Dreamy Moon Knife. Got a play set. One Jigazor. It's from my buddy. Um, we got Dreamy Moon Knife. Um, this guy. This Uncanny Turnip. Uncanny Turnip. Yeah. Um, comes in if you have two survivors on the board. He's the third. You ramp one, then pick one guy from back for mana. So, very, very good card. Never got the chance to get him. So, yeah. Got my Dreaming Moon Knife. And Uncanny Turnip here. All right, I love this card. I don't know. I, I love this guy. I think this card's awesome. Oh, he is awesome. Can't disagree with you there. All right. Wow, this is a long series. Holy moly. All right, so... <laughs> Since Wave Strikers are coming to Duel Masters plays, I only thought it necessary to get every single Wave Striker ever printed in Japanese. So there's a Wave Striker that a lot of you guys don't know exist if you don't follow the Japanese game. And this guy I forgot his name, but when he comes in, if you have two or more Wave Strikers, I think you can pick one back from your graveyard. He's a six out six for six double breaker. Yeah, I didn't know that. I could only six. find two copies of this guy, but um, he's pretty cool. I don't know if he's very playable. We haven't More seen which... Sparrow Gate yet, right? The Beyblade one? Or is that not in here? That's here. Okay. Is it in here? I don't know. I really honestly forgot. I, I hope it's it. I don't think it's here, to be honest with you. I think it's in coming from another website. But look, we got this guy, Wave Striker, when he comes in with two other Wave Strikers, blows up the field. I don't know how I feel about that, because you're blowing up the field and you have three guys. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Got every Wave Striker you could ever imagine, so we're going to have a lot of fun experimenting with that. All right. That uh, annoying packaging. <laughs> They're all annoying. I think all these white envelopes yeah, are from the that. same guy. I, no, I think I should be. Uh, I just don't need the don't even chance it. Just give it to him. Alright. Another annoying package. Yeah, this is all from yeah, the same guy. Nice. He does a good job. Thanks. Alright, got he my does gladiators. Do a good job. It's just. Uh, and when you use a knife, it's not as bad. Yeah. Oh, you did get more Elzoni. Yeah, I got a playset, so. Just so you have five. Thing. Yeah, I got it. I usually got an extra copy if it was cheap and I was worried one would come fucked up. Yeah. You know. Alright, let's see. 
more annoying. Got seven dollars or something. Thanks. All right, this is just Hazaria. Oh, I guess, yeah, the order wouldn't go through unless I only ordered him. But yeah, Hazaria, do good thorns. Last Wave Striker, got all of them a playset. Um, and he comes in, your opponent chooses and kills a guy if you have two other Wave Strikers. Pretty good card. Thanks. All right. Oh, last but not least for Wave Strikers, Killsteen. Um, Who's actually getting buffed and buffed. BMP. <laughs> Crazy <laughs> card. This card is now six man in Dual Masters plays. So we'll probably use that. Um, yeah. We'll see. see yeah, happens. we'll see. Um, gives all your guys plus 5k double breaker and blocker. Fucking insane. I mean, I think it's going to be tier zero. It might have to get nerfed. Wow, this is a big envelope. Holy Open shit. That last. What the fuck Open is in there? <laughs> <laughs> Holy yeah, we'll shit. That, last. that has to be the biggest order. Or is it? I don't know. Do these next, I'm curious to see what's in there. Oh, you're already doing one. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that's annoying packaging too. No, I think it's easy. I got it. I don't think he's... Oh, it's not taped, I agree. Yeah. All right, oh. Ghastly Dream. So, this card works wonderfully with um, Miraculous Meltdown. We're gonna have a lot of fun. This card was limited to one in Japan, I believe. It was deemed too broken because there's too many decks that, um, I forgot what it was doing, but yeah, there's, oh yeah, there's super shield triggers, so. Actually, wait, could you... I, I don't remember why this was broken, but there was, there was some degenerate combos in there. Yeah. I don't know why they're shipping in these envelopes. I mean, I don't see it necessary. It's a little excessive. All that for one little thing. That's what I'm saying. It's like kind of <laughs> weird. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe they do that because they, they anticipate more things. I don't know. Some places have weird shipping. All right. Yeah. So this guy, a lot of you will probably have no idea who the hell this guy is. He's actually a card that um, I looked up on my own. I was just looking through Angel Commands. His name is Alka Kid. This guy is actually pretty insane. So what he does is he's an angel command and when you put him in the battle zone, you draw a card and then whenever you cast holy awe, only holy awe, you get to put an angel command evolution creature in the battle zone. So if you have him in the battle zone, you cast holy awe, you can put Alcadius or Alphadios or any other angel command um, evolutions on him for free. Yeah. Interesting how it's yeah. card specific. I, yeah. I don't think I've ever seen that. I mean, honestly, at first you think, wow, broken, like five for five, draw a card, then you get to cast Holy All and then cheat in Alphadios. But yeah, I mean, no. this, you need a lot of things. You need him to be on board, cast Holy All, and summon the evolution. And each of those, yeah. casting each takes like a whole time. Exactly. Okay. So he's like a combo piece. Very cool. Though. I really like the card, the, the flavor of the card. Would have definitely made Alcadius more playable in the TCG. Yeah, but I digress. All right. What the hell? All right. That's super weird, man. All right. Um, Terror Pit. I had ordered uh, seven other ones, so I got my playset finished here. Right, one of my favorite things to unbox. More Gantas. This was a this was um a big lot, so I got a really good price on this. That's why these all came together. We gotta make sure these envelopes are empty. There's yeah. a lot going on there. This is so we got four Gantas. We got four Cavern Raiders. This is like a Beast Folk lot that I saw, and it was pretty good price. And I I love these guys anyway, even though I already had a, almost all of these. But yeah, I got I got two more play sets of something. I got Windax and I got Piggy. So yeah, pretty sick, no? Aren't the silver borders gorgeous? Yeah, they're really nice. <laughs> I like them a lot. All right. All right, we're at nine minutes on the video. All right, nine yeah, minutes. Sorry. All right, open one more. We'll do one more, I got it. That's it? Yeah. All right, cool. Ooh. All right, we got one of my favorite cards ever. Petrova. I'm not sure I think we got, did it. we get that already? One time? No, not this. This one. is a different okay. Petrova. This is four copies of my favorite, uh, one of my favorite Dual Masters cards. Uh, a lot of memories with this card, but uh, definitely going to have fun with Petrova. Uh, that's it for this video. Tune in for the next part.